everyone, this is Crystal, and today I'm showing you how to make this compass card, which is perfect for Father's Day, a birthday, or just to tell the man in your life that I love you. So for this project, you'll need a piece of cardstock that is four and a quarter by six and a quarter, and a piece, another piece of paper for the background that is six by four, which you can see I'm gluing this on. And then we'll also need another piece of paper that is six by four that's double sided. And so what I'm doing now is I'm finding the center of the long side and I'm taking my pencil and I'm marking a line. And then from each end I'm marking an inch and a half. And those will be our cut lines. And now you'll see I'll take the paper and I want to fold it from the corner to the cut line, which like I guess it was an inch and a half, and fold it back. It's like a peekaboo card. It's, it's similar to this. And now I'm folding back the other side, just like I did the first one. And then I'm creasing it really well. I would normally use my bone folder, but to be honest, I can't find it with all the mess on my desk. And now we'll do the same thing on the other side. So basically it's what you would call a double peekaboo. And it gives us that X. And it kind of reminds me of an hourglass. And since the back of this paper is a metallic paper, the art glitter glue won't stick to it real well, so instead I'll be using large glue dots and I'll put them like in each of the corners and down through the middle to make sure it holds it securely. And then I'll add it to the front of the card. And then I'll take my art glitter glue and I will glue down the inside corners of each side so they lay flat. I'll be using the stamp set Celestial, that's what it's called, and I'm using the, camp, the compass stamp, and then I'm also going to be using um, You Are My True North. So I brought out my Misty because I want to heat emboss the stamps. So I'm going to stamp each one first in Versamark ink and then I'm going to stamp over it using um, Knight of Navy. And then I'll take uh, clear embossing powder over it and then I will go and I will heat set it. That's just a little trick on how to heat emboss um, your stamps in whatever color you want if you don't have that color um, embossing powder. So just if you want to stamp it again to make sure you have a clearer stamp, after you put your color on you have to clean your stamp and then stamp again with your Versamark and then your colored ink. So now I'm taking a two and a half inch circle punch and I punched out the, the compass and then I decided that I wanted to put some black behind it. So I punched out a two and three quarters inch circle punch and, and then I glue them together with art glitter glue and then I pop it up using foam tape to add it to the front of the card. And this card is actually just a flat card. It isn't um, a card that you open or anything. And there you go. And then I decided that I wanted to stamp the sentiment on black cardstock and stamp it in white. I just thought it would give it um, a different look to it. 
And now I'll just cut the sediment down with my scissors to fit. I wanted it to fit in the top there. So I'll have to cut off the bottom corners, kind of angle it to get it to go in. And then I'll use my art glitter glue and I will glue it in there. If you like what you see, please give me a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel. Please share my video on your social networks. Bye for now. Happy crafting.